Gemini versus Gemini, today on Vintage Space. All right, so this is without question one of the most frequent comments I get on any video where I even mention the Gemini program. Gemini was, of course, NASA's second manned spaceflight program, what I like to think of as NASA's overlooked middle child. It was essentially the interim program between the Mercury and Apollo programs, designed to work out all of the hard things about going to the moon, like orbital rendezvous, EVA, and extended spaceflight using fuel cells. It was also designed to keep America in space between the Mercury and Apollo programs because Apollo wasn't exactly ready to fly the second Mercury was done. So enter Gemini, the program that taught NASA how to fly in space. It's a phenomenal program, but most people really just want to know, is it pronounced Gemini or Gemini? I've always pronounced it Gemini, in part because of this book, Rocket Man by Nancy Conrad and Howard Klausner, which is the excellent biography of Gemini astronaut Pete Conrad. Unlike the zodiac sign named the Gemini, pronounced Gemini, the NASA guys preferred pronouncing it Gemini, as in cricket. Still don't believe me? Check out all of these NASA film reels describing it as the Gemini program. Anticipation was high for Gemini. Gemini began counting down. Gemini 1, Gemini number 1 lifted smoothly off the pad. The second flight test of the Gemini program. Gemini 3, the Gemini launch vehicle. It's Frank Foreman and Jim Lovell on the status of the Gemini 7 spacecraft. The prime pilots for the Gemini 6 flight, Wally Shira and Tom Stafford, the launch of Gemini 6. Gemini uh, 7 and 6, would you continue with the description of your station keeping? Six weeks after the launch of Gemini 9, astronaut John Young, command pilot of Gemini 10, and pilot Michael Collins, Gemini 10 lifted from launch pad 19. Gemini launch vehicle. Gemini 10. Gemini 10. Gemini, 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 Gemini major Gemini objective. So, Gemini. Are you guys still going to contest it? Are you still going to comment every time I mention it that it's pronounced Gemini? Let me know what pronunciation you prefer in the comments below and whether this video has altered your perception on the Gemini versus Gemini debate. And of course, leave me any questions about the Gemini program or any other early spaceflight programs you've got and topics that you would like to see covered on future episodes. Be sure to follow me on Twitter. I'm at AST Vintage Space for daily Vintage Space content and with new videos going up every Friday and the occasional little video going up on Tuesdays as a bonus, subscribe right here so you never miss an episode.